not like I'm addicted to this game or anything, Baka. I say as I <laughs> open it up for the second time in the same day after I eat dinner. But hey, what's up? Good evening. Uh, happy, happy Monday. Happy whatever. I'm gonna play this for another hour and a half, I think. <laughs> because, you know, why not? And then I can do other work. It's a game, just, uh, it's, it's in my mind palace, as we like to call it. But, it is what it is. We can now accomplish more stuff. I am gonna have to be careful on the time, though, just because we did play for four hours earlier. Not me. <laughs> Not me. <laughs> um. Oh yeah, we're still in camp. I was like, what? Why is he here? That didn't make sense at first. But we'll be okay. We'll figure it all out. It'd all be good. Good in the neighborhood. Oh. Yeah, I, I'm here. Half eaten, okay. Ooh. That contraption's a hot ticket item. Might not be our last scrap for its sake. The demon aura. I should shut it off. It's useless right now. An unfinished conjuration spelled marred by teeth mark and dried slaver. Shekken Ixen's mag. Lotta. Interesting. going on over here. Ok. 
kẽ Dead Lurgar in the soil. Oh, that's not what I wanted, but okay. Thank you. Let's see what we have here. You better not mess this up, please. Thank you. Okay. Oh. Could have been worse. A Zentrum symbol. Those outdoors must be operating. Yeah, well, I, I knew that already, though. So. suppose if you didn't, it would be like, oh! Well, I mean, but you have to take the elevator down here anyway. There we are. There we go. 
Awesome. Doesn't work. Doesn't work. Oh yeah, Arcane Tower is the last part. Um, well, we gotta go up here anyway. Instead of teleporting. Here. Everyone's gone. Why are you still screaming? to be something. No time to waste. lot going on. We could possibly get from search all. Risen Road closed due to inclement weather. Seek marked detour.
Okay. Maybe we were supposed to just detect thoughts on her while she was passed out. I don't know if that was intentional. But if it was, that's my fuck up. Regardless, we need to go do this. <laughs> uh. What do we have here? Wait, no, no, no. Let's get going. Same is simple enough. S Susar. Before I do that, I'm going to check what the thing says. What else does it need? I'm confused. Let me read this again. Okay. Of what kind? Uh, sickle and dagger. Someone there. Yeah. Uh. an offering. A candy sweet scent wafts forth. The Sousa bark infuses the weapon from within the flames. The flames sputter away. The dagger is yours for the taking. Excellent. Uh... I just get nice. 
Worth it. We uh Time to try the arcane cower, I guess. Keep going. Ow. Yep, this is the way we want to go. Why are we slowing down? Now that those paladins are out of your way, what's next on the agenda? First things first, I need to get this engine tuned up. Thing's powerful, but it's been feeling volatile ever since I left the hells. Can't be too hard to find an infernal mechanic around here, right? You and Mizora seem to know each other. How? We were both part of Zariel's inner circle. Her by choice, me by force. In the grand scheme of things, I'm inconsequential to Zariel. Sure, I've got the engine, but I wasn't even her strongest fighter. She favored me like a child favors a captive pet. Mizora envied the attention, I suppose. I'm sure when Zariel gave her the order to hunt me down, Mizora was delighted. Do you think she'll keep coming after you? I don't know. You think she'd have more important things to do? Devils and their pride. So, about our tadpole powers. You really did it, huh? Not worried about adding more lithid into the mix? Well, what can I say? You look fine, smell fine, seem fine. And yet, you're more mind flayer than ever. Hope you don't expect me to follow your lead in this. It's your choice, but I think the tad tadpoles make me stronger. Do they? I'm not sure either of us can say one way or the other. We don't know what the costs might be just yet. We might be facing a cult more powerful than we know. We need all the help we can get. Goofy. I'll roll again. Add bonus. Didn't need it, but okay. Oh! How do you do that? 
always making sense when I least want you to. <sighs> Fine. I'll keep an open mind, all right? I can promise that much. Now, are we done here? My faith will guide me. Feel my mistress's wrath. Actually, no, Shadowheart. I need. I need you to keep moving. Let's get on with it. I must keep going. Keep your distance, darling. I'm ready. Hey. Whatever it takes. Move. to rest. The charmer. While I'm at it.
worth it. Nothing much I can do. I wonder what the next move is. Oh boy, here we go. First, we let's move. Moving ahead. Hey, ho. Saddle up. Subtle steps. A light without a wick. How are you meant to use the damn? Waste. 
I'll take this way. Magic. Don't touch me. No one back home will ever believe this. Oh, I could go for a good meal. drink that for her Need to keep going. Hmm. Might as well. something useful. Better take a look. Oh. I shouldn't have wished to live in more interesting times. Did it expire? Ahead. 
myself. Moving it. <laughs> Pardon me. Ooh. What's next, I wonder? Onward. Deep and move. Making me sweat. La la la. This way. Worth a shot. I should take that. Come on. I'm just so quiet because I want to ensure that I get this. Swift as my feet can carry me. Out the door. You can close it. Okay. On I go. Keep a blade close. Don't linger. All 
all's well that ends not as bad as it could have. <coughs> Never wanted the easy path. <sighs> Better than nothing. Hmm. It's like some kind of magical contraption. Now to get it to work. Mm. What do we do? No way to ignite these. Strange. Commit. What am I to do? Ah! Attention. Sometimes you gotta jump. Uh! What now? Jump. Play the sweet, sweet music. Uh huh. Come on. You need it. All right. Time to see what new horrors waiting for us. God damn it. <coughs> These boots have seen everything. Mm. What's that? I can't tell because you're showing me the inside of the building and I don't know what you're looking for. I'm way too big. No time to dally. I don't know why you jumped back up. That was your own that was your own fault. There we go. These things have stayed interesting. Might be useful. Oh, 
cursed to put my hands on everything. No way to ignite these. Strange. Mm. Yeah, I wanted to use it. So, um, so that he's What's next? back a little bit. Onward. Ever onward. Mm. Check for anything useful. That's useful. Um. somewhere.
someone there? May the darkness protect you. Oh, you don't have time for that. On my way. I don't remember this puzzle very well. Nice. Hello. What can I do for you? Oh my god, that's terrifying. I know it's just because of the way the light is lit, but oh, oh, <laughs> that was horrifying. With haste. No traps, please. I'll give it a shot.
disk is formed from slate and engraved with Githyanki writing. You examine them closely, but can't make much sense of them. Without a cipher or primer to aid you, the disk's message could be near impossible to discern. Oh, okay. Abram really out here, Paul. He knows the language, I guess. In your mind's eye, the symbols trade places with each other until a clear pattern forms. And from that pattern, a story emerges. Okay. What is it? What's the story? What's the story? I'm waiting. I'm waiting. I'm waiting. I'm excited. The Prince of the Comet, Part 1. So it was that we were free from gate shackles and turned our blades on each other. The heavens were shattered and one great empire was divided in two. I mean, I know this, but... Gith traveled to the Hells to broker help for her people, her cause. Flacketh would have you believe Mother Gith proclaimed her our queen. Lies. Gith made no such proclamation. Flacketh seized the empire against the mother's wishes. But Gith had nurtured a son, Orpheus, prince of the comet, the true heir. He knew Flacketh's treachery. I actually knew Orpheus all this stuff, but Gith's it's honor still guard good. And declared the throne for himself. The war of the comet had begun. It's an intriguing tale, and a forbidden one, given how expertly it was encoded. Lazel will surely want to know of this. Strange disc. Are these Githyanki markings? Lazel might know. The roads to darkness, an epic tragedy about power, corruption, and loneliness. Prologue, a rowing, a lonely road. Thunder and lightning enter Soreth. New sounds through damp and dark oppression break. Is it thee, foe, that foul, contemptuous heel? Or art thou, friend, a rescue from my lonely wake? Come out of love for me, not love for blood and steel. And Teresia. How would I know? How would I know, Soreth? It's been so long. What do I know of you and you of me? Wait, do you hear that sound? Enter Amphius. What's this? Those figures so familiar both, but still seem so strange. It's Amphius. Dear Amphius, what happened to your face? It's pale as death. Your eyes are as black as Shar. And you? I saw your teeth. They're sharp as blades. And what is this road so slick with blood? What happened here? Happened to us all. Excellent. End prologue. Act 1. Ten years prior. The rest of the play tells a tale of three elven friends are passed a power and how corrupted, mad, and lonely they killed each other. Okay. Damn. Damn. Dearest Lenore, I am not sure that I should say this, but your last rather really worried me. Why in all hells would you tame a boule just because you found it near Myrna's grave does not mean that's a sign. I'm really worried about you, Lenore. A boule is not a pet. Using it as a guardian is one thing, but you sound quite taken by it. I know you don't want to come back before you finish your research, but if you're feeling lonely, you know my door is always open. Lots of lugs, love and hugs, Amareth. P.S. It really warms my heart to hear that you put the Omnicrus flowers on Myrna's graves. I remembered she liked to roll around in them even though she'd always sneeze after. She was such a soft, loyal dog. I wish there was more I could do. Hmm. Light it. Light the can't thank you. That, that'll 
fit in my pack. Thanks. Toast, toast. Big shiny eye. Makes me dizzy. Feet planted firmly on Faerun. We are going to save. Yep. <laughs> Because I do know what happens. I'm not going to lie in a little bit. I do have to play it safe. You sound like a damp and like a pressure break. Is it the foul? The foul contemptuous heel? Or art thou friend, a rescue from my lonely wake? Come out of love for me. Not love for blood and steel. How can I trust? How will I ever know? How can I show myself my darkest me? That was impressive. Still alive, so that's progress. Much better than last time I tried this. What path lies before me? Always room for more. I was fully expecting to cap that out with a fight. Let's have a look. Strange place for a button, especially one that doesn't work. Who the gray? From Barakar we made our stand, meant to rule but led astray. By wicked tentacle and wicked hand, this world belongs to the Grey. Orindal stole all we had, yet taught the weapons by which we slay. Forge your minds to ironclad, this world belongs to the Grey. The exile freed us with his command to conquer what has been taken away. Crush every monument to the finest sand, this world belongs to the Grey. Trade your heart for the steel intent, for with whip in mind we flay. Let them hear of our descent. The world is nothing but gray. Is it referencing a mind flayer? Intriguing. Also, we can. What's the story? We can send this back to camp because I do not need it anymore. Yeah, that's pointless. On my way. I mean, it was because I was a bard, but you know, last time I just for clarification, I got attacked by that dude up top, so that's what I was preparing for. But you know, we bard now, we know play. 
we expert in play. The beginning of this book proudly declares it to be a play by Dame Inia, followed by an extensive introduction and 23 pages of notes on its text. Though the book itself seems barely touched, one stanza is encircled twice. There's a light in every living thing. It's crawling towards the surface to survive, and in its wake it tramples everything. We'll kill the rest so that the one can survive. What is... That's an odd play. You know, I like... I enjoy my poetry as much as the next creative-minded individual, but I don't know, certainly, certainly not what comes to mind when I consider, I mean, plays don't always have to be optimistic, but I'm like, that's pretty, to the left oh, oh, oh. And... can she do it? Yep, she can. Well, it's worse than what I have, but it's not terrible. There's really no reason to trade it. We found him. Time to get on board the ship. A vessel wobbles on the lake's murky waters. Ooh, something's happening right now. Okay. I'm down, computer. Sail into the darkness. We all have dark vision. Not sure how that's functional. Raft. Where's Gek? Who are you? In the name of the absolute, in the name of the absolute, you will let me pass. in a twist. Well, come on. Let's get you to shore. You'll need to report to the sergeant. You lot, keep patrolling. I'm heading back with this one. You continue forward in silence until the lights of a camp twinkle through the murk. Yep. 
think we're coming finally to the last area that was in the early access that I remember, which is positive. Sideways. We got a welcoming party. You shithead! Time you showed up. We got trouble. Spit it out. Sergeant finally choked on true soul near's prick. Drug no. The twat soul caused a rockfall. Trapped tighter than a ring on a fat finger. You're shitting me. You pay up? <sighs> That's the trouble. He's got the gold on him. Sergeant's arm is falling off with all the gnome slaves she's been beating. Who's the hoon, Greyman? Another slave for the dig. Call me slave again, and I'll feed you your own stomach. Oh, this one's feisty. Thrin's gonna knock the snot right out of him. I am a true soul. You will treat me with respect. That's so. I... You feel the slightest of stirrings in your head. The Dwergar is not infected, yet your minds resonate. Oh, I'll be... You ain't shitting. Felt the tingle. Your twat soul chum owes us a load of coin. You want through? Make a donation. I'll take your head before I take you take my gold. Unclog your hole. Just shitting around. But I'm warning you. That twat soul ain't settled up soon. There'll be hell to pay for the lot of you cult buggers. Saving this near from suffocating or leaving him to die? I'm fine with either, naturally. The last thing I want to do is ruin these nails digging through rock. We're busy, we can't stop for everyone we meet. I could not agree more. To hell's with the ball. At least give me an approval, come on. Dead trial, publicly displayed. Let me see your eyes, Under Elf. Absolute must have took you in. Where did the drow come from? Caught him sniffing around. Easy marks. Had the stench of the toplands. Hung them here as a warning. Ain't no one drugs with clan flame shade. Everyone is so... unhappy. Oh. Well, I meant more than molten rock and plunging chasms, but... Yes, the folk leave something to be desired as well. Present company excluded, of course. Anything to that absolute oh, talk, you. you think? Stop fishing for compliments. Loaded dwarf sounds on my mind. Hey, stick shit! Another hour uh, stick shit! <laughs> Piss pot! You flirt! Now jump to it! 
who is up to the lift, and straight to the shadows. Now that's how you motivate the starve. <laughs> True, soul, yeah. Tell the sergeant we won't move a pebble. I heard a true soul was trapped. Shouldn't you be helping? Hold out your hands, Oon. You heard the man. Let's see him. You want to see my hands? What for? Let's ask in more showing. Fine. Take a look. Five working fingers. Nice and meaty. Prime for digging. You want near? You claw him out. My drinking hand's busy. I don't like your attitude. And I don't like pig shit, but damned if your mouth ain't spewing it. You want respect? Let your absolute pay for it. Till then, bugger off. Hey, stick shit. Where's my drink? Coming right up, piss pot. Stick shit? Dogs like smug. And he wrecked that shroom village. And then shagged it. <laughs> Here's to smug, nasty prick. Piss off. No need to be rude, I'm on your side. My side? I heard the piss pop. You're a true soul. Same as near. So like I said, piss off. My name's Abram. I'm not really a true soul. You're a true soul, all right. You look it. You smell it. So listen close. Or I won't say it again. Piss the drug off. Last chance. You want me to kill your slavers or not? What about piss off, do you? Hold on. You aren't just talking shit, are you? Then shh. Keep it low. Don't let them hear you. Now, why in the hottest hells would a true soul be helping me? It doesn't matter. Do you want my help or not? Fine. You want to spill their guts? I won't stand in the way. But you better finish the job, because I'll be the one to suffer if you don't. <clears throat> Ain't you hearing me, prickhole? Piss off to every last hell! Shove off! I'm not sharing. Alcohol. An odd vice for Dwega, prone to triggering ancestral memories of brutal illithid enslavement. Ah, but alcohol is bad news for a Dwergar. Should you be drinking? And that yammering piss old's bad news for your lifespan, but you keep flapping it. Through the Dwergar's ears, you hear the sizzle of burning flesh and the screams of tortured young. Old pain felt anew. Shit, shit! Beat it! True hole, before I start beating you! You drug needle worm! Oof.
Got it. You're not gonna like this, mate. Go. now go find somewhere to hide wait for things to cool down i know a place across the lake should be safe won't be needing this poison now that you've off the pricks bet you'll find it handy though you're a good one i won't forget it stuff around covered mysteries detect thoughts this one's better I'm not gonna Okay, I'm very rare. The Misty Step is very good, though. a dagger. Yeah, we want to keep this. This can go back to camp. There we 
go. <laughs> yes, this again. Deep no make, but the design is anything but. What was this for? Whoever built it, they've let it rot for ages. Focus with you breathing so close. I should speak up. The slowest of you lot. This ain't a show. Go make yourself useful or get lost. <laughs> I do enjoy it. But I have a part to play, which is a drow of the absolute. To her shadow, let all that is past be forgotten. You're just losing your mind. <laughs> How peculiar! Smooth face, cobbled edges. They're a sign. They must be. What luck! Look here, Hoon. I seek fresh eyes. Care to lend yours to a weary mason? A suspiciously codger welcome from a Dwerkar. Ease your suspicions. I've got no mind for slaving. My passion is stone, and my god is the chisel. But these learned eyes reach their limits, and so I must humbly request yours. Fine. What should I be looking at? The rock, the rubble, all of it, if I may be so bold. Take a look. Tell me what you see, and be thorough. Hmm. Bard. You recall the tale of a Sharon fortress armed with impenetrable adamantine. A metal created by a gnomish mage. There were also whispers of the gnome's secret project, an invincible guardian, though its existence was never proven. What do you think? How fascinating. I told my kinfolk that book learning has book its learning. benefits. Book learning. The gnome, helping forge a fortress that would last an eon. Mythic metal atop stone hewn by the devoted. That's to say nothing of this tale of an invulnerable protector. It's unfortunate the Sharan's successors found no proof. Doesn't explain this infernal plate I found, though. Here. Take it. Perhaps you'll be able to figure out why it's here. But my work has only begun. There is more still to find. I must get to it. I would like to trade. Well, let's see what you've got. Okay, he'll he'll stay alive. Bone, bowl, bucket. Uh. 
Oh, that's a hood. Okay, that's great, actually. We can give that to somebody. This is slightly better. Figured it out. This is a terrible. Plus one. That opens over. Right now, send a camp. I do like the circlet the most, but like, objectively, this is a better choice. I still can't speak with Ted. Can't you just auto move up? Uh, 
to go down there anyway. An orb. Doing the spy. Stare into the eye. Your reflection stares back. The longer you stare, the more uneasy you feel. There is a presence. You are seen. Your consciousness surges into the orb. First, there is blackness. Then, a pair of unblinking red eyes. Pain grips your skull as the eyes stare into you. Then, look away. The connection is broken. The walls are deep, no Skeletons, you realize they are all clad in the same. I know exactly dark who they armor. are. Dark Justicia uniforms. These were Shah worshippers. The same as me. Whatever killed them made a ominous. Let's not linger. I'll keep an eye out. If it's a demon, I'll be able to spot it a mile off. <laughs> Useful. Thank you. Stop it. What armor is this? Okay, that's not super useful. What's in here? Gold accents aren't too tarnished yet. You might be able to chip them off. Hmm. 
see where the nose. Three Found a way past the rock. I'll peel your balls like potatoes if you don't move. And Keep you digging. Or something. Mm. Saw so you arriving. Okay. Almost put a hole in your boat. Don't make me wish I had. Okay, you don't scare me. See how the little pricks do when we strap fire to their legs. <laughs> hmm. Not the most sophisticated way of getting what you want from someone, is it? Move! I don't have time for you. You better make time for a true soul. The parasite stirs, but it's a mere tickle. You hear no thoughts or memories, just an echo of scars that never healed. A true soul, eh? Useless wreck of a lookout could have told me. Glad you're here to take responsibility. Tunnels collapsed. Trapped true soul near. He's stuck in there with poisoned geezers. We don't get him out soon. It's both our heads. Not the head we'd like to see roll, unfortunately. Never thought I'd see these back. Nasty sneak gave even Gek the slip. <sighs> Crafty little shits, these ones. You need a stiff cane to keep them in line. Here then, his bounty's yours. I've got some explosive powder that should do the trick. That's so. Set it near the rubble and ignite it. That'll blow the drow out. The slowest of you lot is getting tossed to a rothi in heat. This is steel. Who could you just both of them on this play? Gnomes speak in soft whispers, the words all but lost in the hot air. Listen, I can help you. Act frightened or you'll draw suspicion. Praise Iron Hand. Lerida, our prayers are answered. Sir, our friends are trapped in the cave in. And I know a way to get them out. Bug, please. Truce or near will. You know what he'll do. 
Leave the true soul to me. Now tell me what you know. Don't, Buck, don't! I've... I've got no choice, Larida. We have to chance it. A few days back, there was a... A scene. Our friend Philomene, she's a sapper, set off a blast and ran off. We set a spot for hiding if someone found trouble. I'll mark your map. If Philomene made it, you'll find her there. She'll have the stuff to blow that tunnel wide open and get Beldron and the rest out. I have some explosive powder. I can use it to get them out. Incredible news. Drop it near the cave in and set it alight. You near the rubble, a fragmented voice clutches at your mind. A true soul. True soul. Finally, you must clear rubble, filling poison. Is anyone else in there? Gnome slaves. Passage trap. Careful of mercs. Get me out. You through Nier's eyes is a blur. You only make out a bit of rubble and a few moving figures. You sense Nier's frustration, tinged with rage, as the connection fades. The slowest of you lot is getting tossed to a rothe and eat. Go. You, grab a cane and whip these droogning beasts into shape. That rubble needs clearing. And my patience is hanging on by an arse whisker. Do your own dirty work. Don't think I won't thrash you harder than the Roth, eh? Something spooks the dumb shits. So stop your join and get to working. You want to thrash me? Go on, then. Drugnin hoon, I'll split you from head to hole. Bloody Rothay have lost it. Put him down. More poisonous, necrotic appendage. Shall we dance? Just a quick, just like old time.
interesting. Out, um, okay. Eat it. Yep. Yep. Ah, oh, man. <laughs> Die. Bye. Go.
Not much use for this slag. Nice speckles, though. Something good here, I hope. Step carefully. There's a trap. Let's go. Not only will we disarm it, we will now unlock. With a flick of the wrist. What's even better? Okay. Come on. I get it. Worth a try. See what I can learn. Unless you're here to kick some stiffs lakeside, I suggest you bugger off. <laughs> I hope you're checking them for loot first. <laughs> you gotta be kidding. These trash don't have nothing on them but rocks. Rocks. I didn't even realize I still had that. You spot a shiny trinket on one of the corpses. 
I'll finish up here. You're wanted with the others. Oof. The negative one cur- Oh! <laughs> In character. Oof. Can't act. Ugh. I ain't going till Thryn tells me to go. Tempers are rising. It's clear not everything you find is at your disposal. Attacked someone. Only the guards are allowed to do that, as this one is about to demonstrate. Gnomes killed under the yoke of slavers. Mm. They deserve better than they got. May they rest in peace. Drow, near, is going to be on his last gasp unless someone digs him out. Though, not necessarily our concern, of course. Uh. Why you gotta be so mean, Asterion? Jesus Christ. Guide us. 
Hey, queen. Damn, 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 damn. Moving in. Yeah, we're good. We're fine. <laughs> they didn't notice. What now? Unlock the door. Okay, that is useful. Smell a trap. Ten out of ten. <laughs> There's a hag pit stench about you. Thank <laughs> you. 
Interesting. Sentinel. Let's go. Happened to our boots. Uh, oh, I had to give them back. That's disappointing. Maybe I should have kept them for myself. What does it mean? Let's go. It's gonna be able to make it anyway. Because <laughs> of those bonuses. Get it. Unlock that door. Stopped me yet. What's up for discussion? Hold it! I swear to Iron Hand. One more step, and a blow is to chunks. An ashen scent fills the air. The barrel is filled with smoke powder, but the scent is acrid, as if contaminated somehow. Or much, much more concentrated. Careful. I'd rather not have to pick bits of gnome from my hair. Shut your mouth, Hoon! Or I'll shut you down! Holy hells, have you gone mad? Damn right, Fecker! 
Now shut your face before I melt it clean off. I know what you are. One of Nia's cult goons. Sailed right in. Better to die in this shit eat than rot in Moonrise. You want me? Come get me. Larida sent me. The gnomes need your help. Yeah, it's still enough. Larida! Ruddy mind games! I, I know all about your tricks, true soul! Shit! I can't do it! Go on! Drag me to Moonrise! I'll make you cult nutters suffer! Calm down, Beldrin's trapped in a cave in, and I need the smoke powder. You want to waste rune powder on- Look, you have no idea what you're dealing with. Any true Iron Hand would trade their life for a grain of this stuff. It's the whole damn reason we're here, and I'm not leaving without it. But let me go. Maybe I'll spare you a vial. Mm. I don't know. My book learning has felled me. Vague notions of rumor and myth. Nothing solid comes to mind. Deal. Listen. You see Larida at the dig? Tell her I'm dead. Impaled. Half eaten. I don't care. Make up a story. And I thought I heard it all. That's some Cambian level deception. You'd abandoned your beloved? That's mighty cruel of you. Beloved? I might have been hers. She sure as hell wasn't mine. <gasps> I'm getting gone. <gasps> to do the, same. the tea. Seems simple enough. This fragment appears to be part of a larger stone slab. The top edge is cleanly hewn, but the bottom is jagged. So said Shar to me, Kethric Thorm. It was Lord Eo who created chaos, and it was from the chaos that I formed. It is who I anoint you, my paladin. From this day forth, let my law be yours. The law of secrets. What is a secret but the truth cast on to darkness? Lurk in the shadows and listen for hushed words. The softer of thought spoken, the more power it contains. The more discord it sows. The more scars it may carve. The man brags of a fair, carry his words to his wife. The water's daughter steals from her father, whisper the truth. The deceived turn to Shar. Cuckolds find solace and shadow. Do this. Oh, oh, <laughs> okay. We were going somewhere. Law of Obeyance, the word of Kethric Tharm is the word of Shar. You will put no god nor mortal above him. You shall question him in neither word nor deed. When the sun has fallen and the moon is new, bow your head in prayer. Proclaim your devotion to Shar and her paladin, Kethric Thorm. Promise your soul and flesh, and seek no fortune nor favor. When your prayer is finished, speak thus, Mistress Sar. I have glorified your name, Master Thorm. I have cried out your word. I am your servant forevermore. So said Shar to me, Kethric Form. So it is decreed, and so it is done. Wield the power of secret where light shines, extinguish it. Heed the word of your mistress and master. Do this, and the Lady of Loss shall know you. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Sounds really neat. 
Nice. Very well then. Nice rope. Someone used it to climb up in. <laughs> Goofy. On your feet, or I'll bite your toes off one by one. What? Neat threat, I guess. Come on, get over here. and use fire to explode it maybe you want to you know get out of the way um all right then oh, attack someone only the guards are allowed to do that, as this one is about to demonstrate. The benefit of the doubt can only be bought so many times. This one. I don't understand! Called rune powder. That didn't make sense, though. Out of the way. Blast the thing to bits. I'm, I'm about to, but maybe y'all should, you know, step back like I am. <laughs> okay, you two are about to die. 
And it isn't my fault this time, it's yours. Oh, I could go for a good meal. Finally. Worthless slaves! Your incompetence has been my ruin! Nay, it does not fail. Absolute gave you everything. And this fiasco is how you reward her? Me and mine worked flat out. I was cracking the whip day and night. Tell him, true soul. <sighs> Near pities you, Thryn. Your errors and excuses. And your sorry. End. Hells. Your skull buzzes, and you see your own face through Nier's eyes. Worthless. Every last one. Their failures must be punished. True soul, take their heads. The absolute commands it. Show them no mercy. Their corpses will make a fine offering to our mistress. Knocked out Shadow Heart. Oh, in my thrall. to learn the hard way. <laughs> the fact we got. Give, a, give him some real hurt.
I think we're fucked. Well, fair enough. I don't know where we last saved. Ugh, disappointing. Disappointing. But it is what it is. We should have taken the it's my own fault. We're gonna do the same thing next time. As long as I can remember exactly what I picked, because that's a different question. Calls it. I am not gonna deal with that right now. <laughs> We're gonna go to camp. We're gonna do the typical. 
faint voice echoes in your mind. I sense you, true soul. Come to me. Come to me. The poison spread. Did you hear that? The poor evil cultist needs our help. Mir's voice fades, but your head still tingles with his anger and fear. Yes? What path lies before me? Should tell Wazel. Glad to have an ally. Speak. The disc appears in your mind's eye. Lazel sees it too and considers the vision. Tisu markings. Ancient. I recognize them, but I can't make sense. No. Wait. The texts are enciphered, but I've solved the pattern. It's a story. About... about Orpheus. Your <gasps> head buzzes in concert with Lazelle's, but it hardly matters. Even without the connection, you'd recognize her discomfort. Dear Sue, what does that mean? Githyanki writing. Every word a wheel. Every letter is spoke. The most powerful texts are engraved in slate. Some so ancient, only the most erudite Gish can read them. Who's Orpheus? I've read this one already, what do you make of it? Drivel, all of it. Gith declared Vlakith queen of the Empire, and her own son defied her. Orpheus would have ceded control to the Gish. And if it's true? Hmm. And if it's true, it sounds like Vlacketh betrayed Gith and seized the throne. She did nothing of the sort. Thank your good fortunes, I'm a tolerant woman. Or I'd have sliced off a few toes. <laughs> yes! <laughs> the indoctrination! Queen, uh, yeah, that's gonna be it for today. But I mean, I, I know the reality is she actually did do that. Um, that is what Vlacketh did. Uh, she is not a good person, regardless. I mean, it's a, kind of obvious from how the Gith act, but still, if you've watched my D&D campaign, you'll know that I, I do love the Gith-Yankee lore. It's very fascinating. They are really, I feel bad for them. <laughs> I mean, not that the Giths or I are really that great either, but you know, 